and gentlemen, firstly, my apologies for being late. I just caught up with another auction winner for over an hour. So that's an indication the market is still hot, so get in before it's too late. By way of introduction, my name is Danny Jones. I'm proudly to be auctioned here this afternoon. I also assist you with your purchase here today. Obviously, the marketing TV mess throughout the campaign. Ellen Jung is the latest thing agent. Also, Daryl Wickham. We've got the lovely Lee Morris and Michael somewhere. We'll be uh, backing on site, assisted with your competition. So, if you need any help or any questions regarding the property, the contract sale, or some technical advice on your bidding strategy here today, they are here to help. Now, firstly, I'll draw attention to the contract sale, which has been made available to you prior to today's auction and on display for the last 30 minutes. Very straightforward auction contract. You find no difference compared to the others that we're using this state Victoria for residential property auctions. Two parts of contract from the framework of your competition here today. The particular sale, special conditions, general conditions, and then the vendor statement, which is more commonly known as a section 32 document. That contains all the relevant information you need to know in terms of becoming a new owner of this property right here. The particular sale reason follow the marketing agent for owner here today is Rewire Real Estate. And a pro property we sell as the one that you just walked through. A lovely, lovely four bedroom, two baths with two car accommodation on a lot of approximately 580 square meters. As inspected, will be in the same condition and delivered to you in approximately 90 to 120 days time. The contract you'll be signing, ladies and gentlemen, will be under auction conditions in the state of Victoria, which means it is unconditional. There is no cooling off period. 10% deposit is what we need from you upon signing the contract sale and of which $20,000 is the minimum amount that we require you to transfer if you do choose to pay the way of the EFT uh, upon signing the contract sale. Very straightforward auction, uh, auction contract indeed. And also as your auctioneer today, it's my duty and responsibility to ensure today's auction is conducted in accordance with the rules that set out in your sale land regulations 2014 schedule one, or any additional conditions that's made available for inspection prior to today's auction. The rules prohibits the false bidding, major interruptions by bidders, a bidder try to prevent other, other bidders from bidding, or any other illegal activities that are fine for these conduct. And bidders will be indicated upon request by me as the auctioneer. The rules does permit vendor bids. The terms I will use to indicate I'm making a bid on behalf of the vendor will be simply vendor bid. And by law, only I as the auctioneer here today can make a vendor bid. Lastly, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to be the one assigning one of these contracts in about 15 to 20 minutes time from now, please pay particular attention to the next two rules because they are crucial for your success here today. One, by law, as the auctioneer, I cannot accept any bids or offers that's made after I declare the property sold. So before I knock it down to the successful person here today, I'll simply call out three times, like so, first call, second call, third and final call, and once the property has been knocked down, I can't take any more bids. Plenty of rewind stuff on site to help you with your bidding, so make sure your bids are heard loud and clearly before you lose your competitor. And lastly, our owner has a reserve price in event if we fall short of that reserve. By law, only the last bidder, the highest bidder, will have that first opportunity to buy this property at our owner's reserve. Now, ladies and gentlemen, welcome again to today's auction in McLean Court in Burwood East. An exclusive opportunity, exclusive pocket of a real estate. There's nothing in the surrounding area. In an estate lifestyle, low maintenance, but also at the same time they offer you the lifestyle, the luxury space for you to have a full-size family home. Doesn't matter what size your family is, it offers a space for each one of your members. Four bedrooms upstairs, and a separate living areas downstairs, and not to mention in a cost of that uh, location, which means there's no through, cut through traffic, and everything that Burwood East has to offer is pretty much right here on your doorstep. Only a few moments.